Shalom, Shalom, Israel, coming back at you with another lesson. Lord willing, this is edifying. First off, giving all praise, all honor, all glories to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rechakwadash. Double honors to the Apostle and Elder Bishop, and all the teachers out there pushing his word in truth, the truth and sincerity, especially now, which they wise to do so. May you give the elect. Shalom to all the Akim and the Akwak out there listening and learning. You Israelites. So-called Negroes, Hispanic, Native, and Seminole Indians, who are the true children of Israel, as well as you speckled bird, Israelite foreigners, the Israelites that look like, act like, and take on the customs of all these heathen nations. So to you, I say Shalom. This lesson is brought to you by the Spirit and the power of Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shah. Yahweh being the true name of our Father, the God of the Bible, the God of the Israelites, by Hashem in the name, and Yahweh Shah. Being the only begotten son of Yahweh, who the world eagerly called by the name of JC. All right, and this lesson is going to go into basically uh, how people are in the world. All right, the um, you know when they when they you know when they make a vow when they make a promise. All right, a lot of these people they just say these things. Right, these are just words to them. And when it comes to being in this truth. Your words is everything, all right? Because what is Zechariah eight sixteen? Right? It says, uh, "These are the things you should do: speak ye every man the truth, right? Ex exercising truth and peace in thy gates." Roughly paraphrasing, all right. Um, so for us, a hey, truth is is everything. You know, you you basically got to be a man of your word, all right. We we can't just be saying things and not follow through with it. Like if you're going if you're gonna say something to somebody, you need to follow through with it. Alright, so basically this, this lesson is gonna go into uh, um, well, technically the word love. Alright. What is love? Love is is an action. Alright? But to, to us, to to us it's an action. To the world, the world is just a word. Alright, so that's what this lesson is going into. And it's titled. Love is an action to us and just a word to the world. All right. So, Lucky, I'm in the middle of cooking. Um, and this is, uh, this is John 13 34. And it reads A new commandment I give unto you that ye love one another. As I have loved you, that ye also love one another. Well, how do you do that? Right? The golden rule, right? Do unto others as you'd have them do unto you, right? Which is also in the scriptures. Okay? So when you when you love somebody, what are you gonna do? You're gonna care for them. You're gonna tend to them should they need tending to. Alright? Check up on them. Things like that. Or, or if somebody gives you a call, right? You give words of encouragement, right? See what you can do to help them out. You know, offer, offer an ear. Sometimes you don't even need to offer advice. Sometimes you just need to lend your ear, all right? Let a brother speak on, on a matter, you know? Help a brother out some type of way, whatever, whatever, uh, whatever means of help that they need. You see? So it's the same thing, at least for me, you know, if Yahweh Shai was on scene and he needed my help or something, I'm going, I'm going to do it. All right. So it's the same thing when I look at the brothers, you know, brother need help. Okay. This is Yahweh Shai needing help. Brother need help with this. Brother need help with that. Hey, can, can you help me with this? I'm going to do what I can to help that brother. All right. However, however means I can help that brother. That's what I'm going to do because it's the same thing. It's helping Yahweh Shai. Right? Just as he loved us, we, we are to love one another. Okay? This is Ecclesiastes 5 and 4. It says, When thou vowest a vow unto the Most High, defer not to pay it. When you when you make a vow to Yahweh Shai, don't put it off. Don't just make it just fucking words. Right? Follow through. Like, a, like as an arrow is shot. Alright? Follow through. Be true. Alright? Let be that arrow, be be fire true. Okay? 
Don't misfire. Don't uh, uh don't make a bad name for yourself. Okay, that's first and foremost, right? Other than uh, uh you know, uh, underneath, shall I say, underneath the fact that you did make a vow to the Lord. You know, whenever whenever I'm helping a brother, that's my first first thought uh to it all. Yeah, I'm helping a brother, but no, I'm I am ultimately helping Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. You see, because at the end of the day, what what are you in the truth for? You in the truth because Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai woke your ass up to be in the truth. So he should be getting all the praise, all the honor, all the glory. Well, this is part of the body. You see, so when you part of the body, you're helping brothers, sure. But you're ultimately helping Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. All right? Helping the brothers helps them move forward to be able to continue on in, in the body and do the works. All right? Uh, uh, helping them with whatever burden that they may have. You see? So it says, when thou vow, Ecclesiastes 5 and 4, when thou vowest a vow unto the Most High, defer not to pay it. For he hath no pleasure in fools. Pay that which thou hast vowed. Don't fall back on your word. Don't be a nigger. Okay? You make a vow to the Lord, follow through. Okay? That's the whole point. You follow through with what you said you're going to do. Be a man of your word. Right? That's the whole point. This is Philippians 2, and I'm going to read 4 through 8. It says, Look not every man on his own things, but every man also on the things of others. Because when, you know, a, a shepherd with his flock... Right, he's not out there tending uh, to uh, things of himself. He's tending to the flock. Right, whatever things he got going on, hey, that shit can wait. I'm on a job right now. You see, not out there uh, 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 worrying about what you got going on. I mean, you do, but you know, when it when it comes to the body, you you focus on what's what's happening. Right, you're not just looking about what you need to do, what what you gotta have. You know, brothers need help some type of way. Help them out. Okay, it's not it's not always uh, about what you want to do and what you need to do. You know, sometimes a hey, uh, uh, the Yahweh Bashim Al Shai will, will put you in a predicament where it's like, hey, you said you wanted to help. Well, here you go. Here's your here's your opportunity to make do on what you what you were asking. <laughs> you know, and he's gonna put you through it. You said you was going. You said you wanted to do this, so here you go. You said you needed this, well, here you go. Here's an opportunity to see if you got what 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 you wanted. You know, he'll present things to you in, in such a way. All right, look not every man on his own things, but every man also on the things of others. Let this mind be in you, which was also in Mashiach Yahushai, who, being in the form of the Most High, thought it not robbery to be equal with the Most High, but made himself of no reputation and took upon him the form of a servant and was made in the likeness of men. And being found in fashion as a man, he humbled himself and became obedient unto death, even the death of the cross. Did he not? Right? He stayed true to himself and to his disciples and to the world around him. That's the same thing we got to do. You see, it's all about, it's all about uh, making yourself better. If you're following in the ways of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, you want to always make room for improvement. You want to be continuously as, as living water. You know, you don't want to be stagnant water. You don't want to be sitting still, all right, sitting on your damn shoulders. You, you say you, you say you're a brother, but you're not, you're not. You're not proving it, right? You're not you're not living by those words, right? You got to be a, a man of action, not a, not a man of just hearing, right? The scriptures say, uh, "Be ye not hearers only, but doers as well." All right? You don't want to be deceiving yourself. You see? So when you come into this this truth, right? Rather be just the the the, you know the the. Coming back to the statute law, the commandments, the obedience of Yahweh Bashim Shai, right? And or a, a man of the Lord, a, a prophet, 
right? You have to put on as the elect. Well, how is the elect going to put on? The elect is going to follow through with the things that they say they're going to do. They're going to they're going to they're going to have charity one toward another, right? They're going to have brotherly love towards each other, right? They're going to do whatever they can to help a brother out, help brothers out. You see? And and if brothers don't don't repay, you know, because there's times where you know a brother may say, "Oh, hey, you know, I, I I hit you back when I can." Sometimes that brother not be able to, when, even though he said he 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 was able to, right? Don't worry about that. Hey, did the, did the, didn't the Lord say He would take care of you? You see, it ain't about it ain't about these these things of, you know. A, I mean, of course, if a brother pay you back, that's that's fine and good. But if a brother don't pay you back, hey, look. Where are you, where's your focus at to begin with? Your focus is on your Yahweh Yahushai, right? Your focus is on this ministry and, and working out your own salvation with fear and trembling. Don't worry about uh, if this person is going to pay you back or not. The Lord said he got you. You got to believe that the man is not a man that he should lie. He's not going to forget your labor of love. You see? Whatever you're doing in this ministry, it's not it's not forgotten. Everything is being seen. Everything is being recorded. You know? So all you got to do is keep playing your part. You know? This is Hebrews 13. I'm going to read 15 through 16. It says, By him, therefore, let us offer the sacrifice of praise to the Most High continually. And that's the point. Continually. Don't just come in, oh, I'm in, I'm in with great millstone. Uh, yeah, all right, hey, 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 everything good? All right, all right. Now you, now you stagnant. Now you ain't doing nothing. I, uh, uh, I already, I went around the whole camp, helped everybody out. Okay, now I'm good. No, continually, okay? You got to continue. Conti look, look, the Lord woke your ass up. This is the point, right? The Lord woke your ass up because he could have left you being a nigga back in this world. So this is how you're going to repay the Lord? By just doing it whenever you feel like doing it or half-assing it? Part You a part-time Israelite? <laughs> you see? You got to put on, man. You got to continually put on for the Lord. Because what are you trying to do? You're, you're trying to be the living water, right? Or, so I can not trying to be the living water. You're trying to put on as a, a man of the Lord. Right? You're trying to be as living water. Constantly flowing. Constantly moving. Right? Continually. Right? Always abounding in the works. Whatever that whatever that may be. It could be reading. Learning the Hebrew. Right? Uh, 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 charity towards brothers. Right? The brotherly love. Uh, coming, of course, coming out to the line teaching. Going to class. Fellowshipping. Okay? Whatever, whatever time you can fit in, do that. You know? Now, you ain't got to be over-righteous. You ain't got to be there all the time, every time. All right? But you 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 got to make yourself known. Brothers got to know what you want. All right? Brothers got to see how you are. All right? They got to know who you are. They got to know you. All right? We're supposed to, we're supposed to know you. The scripture saying you got to know your brother. You know? The only way you're going to do that is if, and, 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 and truly, is to be consistent, right? You got to be consistent, you know? Brothers got to be able to look at you and be like, oh, yeah, I, I, I know this brother. Huh? Oh, yeah, yeah, I know this brother got me, you know? Oh, yeah, I, this, brother, this brother always, whatever the case may be, you see? That's how it's supposed to be, man, because you're doing what? You're continually... Seeking your how about you shy? You're continually showing brotherly love, all right. Continually flowing with charity, all right. Again, Hebrews thirteen and fifteen says, "By him, therefore, let us offer the sacrifice of praise to the Most High continually. That is the fruit of our lips, giving thanks to Him. But to do good and to communicate, forget not, for with such sacrifices the Most High is well pleased." You see? That's what it's about, man. It, it, it's an action to love, right? 
for 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 those that's in the truth, it's an action, right? This is not just a word to the world, right? That to them is just a word because if they truly loved each other, they would do right by each other, right? The Lord said, "If we love Him, to do what? Keep His commandments." <laughs> They're not grievous, you know. It's about doing what the Lord the, the Lord wants. All right. Did, did not Yahweh Shai say, hey, I'm, I'm here to do my father's business? He didn't make it about him. He made it about his father. Well, we got to follow in, in Yahweh Shai's steed, man. We got to follow in this, the same steps. Many examples how to do that. Many. All right. It's all about staying focused and doing doing what's right by the, the body. Doing what's right by Yahweh Shai. Okay. Okay. Galatians 6, and I'm going to read 1 through 4, says, Brethren, if any man be overtaken in a fault, ye which are spiritual, restore such as one in the spirit of meekness, considering thyself, lest thou also be tempted. All right? Be there. Lift your brother up. You got a friend in me. All right? Everybody seen Toy Story. You know, you know the music. All right? And for, for us older ones, us older uh, uh, brothers and sisters in the truth, Right, lean on me when you're not strong, and I'm gonna be right somebody to lean on. Well, it's the same thing. This your this your brother, right? We'll help your brother out. Your bro your brother needs some some guidance, right? He needs somebody to talk to, lend an ear, right? It ain't always gotta be you gotta say something. Just lend an ear to a brother. You know, let them know you're there for them. You know, you'd be surprised. Uh, just, just, you know, uh, get a phone call from a brother, right? And and just lending an ear. You'd be surprised what that can do for a brother, man. Lift these spirits up, all right? Now they charge up. They ain't ready to go again. Call Halayim like Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai. You see? It's like, it's like a spiritual uh, charging of a battery. You know, because we can get we can get run down in this world, man. This world can run us down, you know. And if you ain't vexed with the, the everyday conversations of the world, well, then that means you're part of the world. But for us, hey, man, we, we get tired of this shit, man. We're ready to go home already. But we know we got to have patience and wait on the Lord. So we do. But with that, hey, your battery is draining, <laughs> right? Your battery is constantly being, being uh, used, man. All right? Because this world is vexing. This world has, has demons all around us. We're constantly battling, you know, the angels looking out for us. It, 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 it's draining, man. You know? So at the end of the day, say, hey, sometimes, like, look, brother might be need need some need to talk, need to need to vent. Right? Lend an ear. What what is it? What is it uh to you to, to lend an ear to a brother, man? It shouldn't be nothing at all. You know? If you, maybe you get, you know, through the spirit, you got some advice, and then you offer some advice. But a lot of times, shit, just listen. You know? Shit, brother, be charged up after that. that, that then that'll charge you up. You know? You in the spirit, hey, you can get charged right back up, too. You know? Shit, there's plenty of times, shit, man, brothers be going through it. You know? I be going through it. I just don't say shit, because I know other brothers are going through it. So, you know, I kind of just keep my shit to the low. You know, when I if I need really, 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 really need some help, then of course I'll say something. But you know, I ain't gonna let myself drown. But um, shit, I be hearing what other brothers are going through, and like shit, I look at my situation I'm like, well, damn, I ain't got it like that. So I'm not gonna say shit. You know, wait, wait till another time. You know, the Lord got me. You know, it's all about having faith, man. Having faith, doing the works of, of an evangelist. Okay, teaching the gospel, rather in season, out of season, constantly talking about Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, man. Malachi three sixteen, perfect, perfect example, man. You know, the Lord see you, He hears you, He know what you want. All right, just do what you got to do in this walk, man. It's really not hard, you know. It says, um, uh, uh verse two. 
It says, bear ye one another's burdens, and so fulfill the law of Mashiach. For if a man think himself to be something, when he is nothing, he deceiveth himself. Because, hey, we ain't got nothing to boast about, man. We got nothing to be proud about. We didn't wake ourselves up. The Lord woke us up. You know? And, and shit, we've done a lot of bad things over these many, many, many lifetimes. So what is there to boast about? What is there to brag about? You know? You should not ever be prideful. You know? Be be meek, man. Be humble. The meek is going to inherit the earth. Not, the, not those that are full of pride. Right? Verse 4, it says, But let every man... Prove his own work, and then shall he have rejoice, rejoicing in him, himself alone and not in another. You see? How you do that? Shit. Doing, doing right for the body. Doing right by the body. Whatever that means. It could be something small. It could be something great. It don't make no difference. You know? Just do what you do. What you do right? Be in your lane continuously. Uh, giving charity upon brothers, man. That's all. That's it. There. That's all. You ain't got to make it complicated. You ain't got to. You ain't got to be uh, deep. Okay. Shit, I have fun being in the shallow end. <laughs> all right. I know how to wade around, look cool and shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right. It ain't about being deep. Shit, the simplicity of y'all shy. All right. There you go. It's about just being simple and, and, and harmon being harmonious. Right? Doing right by the by Yahweh Bashimao Shai. Doing right by the body. Right? Don't think ain't, ain't ain't nothing being noticed. Everything is being noticed. Right? By the angels, by Yahweh Bashimao Shai, the men of the Lord. Okay? Everything's being noticed. Everything's being noted. Alright? It, it's, it's the same thing when you're in the military. You think ain't nobody watching you? Shit, all the higher-ups are watching you to see who's going to be the next leader or, or or if you deserve a promotion or whatever the case may be. So you got to always be doing what? Gradually moving upward. All right? Constantly flowing like water. Because if you stagnate, what's the point of you being here? You're not trying to do anything, but you're just a man on the... You're just a, a nigga sleeping on the couch. Rent-free. Why everybody else getting their ass up and, and, and working and doing this and that? Hell no. Get your ass up and, and, and get off your shoulders and, and get moving, man. It's the same thing in this truth, man. Constantly flowing. Constantly working. Showing brotherly love. Continually. All right? But yeah, that's the point, man. All right? Love is an action to us. But to the world, it's just a word. All right, so hey, Lord willing, this was edifying. Giving all praise, all honor, all glories to Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai, by Hashem Rakakwadash. Double honors to the apostle and the elder bishops of Great Millstone and all the teachers out there pushing this word in truth with truth and sincerity, especially now, risk your lives to do so. May you be the elect. Stay prayed up, repent, not just for this lifetime, but your past lives as well. Ababa, Ball, Kwame Asherala, Shalom.